Mashav, Israel's Agency for International Development Cooperation, was launched in 1958, only 10 years after the State of Israel gained its independence. As a country dealing with scarce natural resources, shortage of water, and a massive wave of immigrants, Israel's first years as a country were extremely challenging and demanded the development of creative and innovative solutions. Equipped with the knowledge and skills acquired through Israel's ongoing development process, Mashab was established with the aim of sharing Israeli know-how to assist other developing countries in overcoming their own acute development challenges. Gender inequality is still deeply rooted within society. It is proven that there is a correlation between gender equality and poverty reduction. Economic and political empowerment of women is a powerful instrument for improving women's status in society and an effective way in reducing poverty. MCTC, the Mashav Carmel Training Center, was established by Foreign Minister Golda Meir in 1961 with the conviction that no people, no nation can expect to solve any problem if the women in that society are not active in all fields, whether it is education, health, social services, or building up the society. Mashav Carmel Training Center, the MCTC, one of the first centers in the world that is dealing with these issues of women empowerment and gender equality. Training programs focus on sustainable community development, early childhood education, and innovation and entrepreneurship. MCTC helps equip aspiring leaders to become agents of change in their communities. The center gives women of all ages the opportunity to build leadership skills and empowers them to be active members of society in the economic, political, and social spheres. Now, in 2018, we still are facing internationally challenges for the equation of uh, women, for the equal rights and equal opportunities for women. We can work together and learn from each other and build a network of women, which is very important. Sharing of ideas, of methods, technologies, sharing of skills and experiences, both professional and personal. Graduate take the knowledge and experience they have accumulated and pass it on in their communities. Women don't have the same networks that men have. This gives them strength, this gives them confidence. We see a lot of participants going back home and starting uh, projects and small businesses to not only make profit, but also give back to the society and answer a need in their community. We believe that these rising leaders can make influential, positive changes in society, become a source of inspiration for others, and to help achieve greater gender equality.